Well, one thing that actually blew my mind that I only found out about it yesterday was that whole rocket that fell in the Indian Ocean. The, the Chinese, Chinese rocket. rocket? Uh, yeah. Jinx, you owe me a soda. That was weird. How do you launch a rocket into space and then not know where it's going to land or where it's going to fall? Well, I mean, I I did a little, not that much. I, I looked a little bit into it and apparently they didn't mean it to leave orbit and it did. So that's why they didn't, and they didn't put like a thing that nearly every rocket has where you can control it from wherever home base is. They literally said fuck it let's not do that Damn. let's take the cheap route wow the chinese route <laughs> <laughs> and uh yeah i guess that happened but hey i mean luckily it fell literally in the middle of the ocean in the indian ocean apparently and it didn't hurt anybody but it's sketchy to know that there's people that are willing to risk other people's lives yeah. for the sake of profit or whatever i don't know yeah what's up with i mean that? like why did they like you're <laughs> You're putting everybody at risk for your stupid little mistake? Well, yeah. Uh, apparently, they were trying to launch some type of module into the space station that they're planning on having a couple of Chinese astronauts in in a couple of years. But, yeah, I don't know, dude. I don't know. It, it gets kind of crazy. Didn't they get criticized by NASA? Yeah, for sure. They were like, yo, that's super irresponsible of you to throw a a rocket into the air and not know where it's going to land or not have, you know, the the proper tools for you to guide it to land somewhere safely. Right. I thought I the mean, US and Russia had like a monopoly on it. Like they're the ones that they're the only ones that could go to the moon per se. That's what I thought. No, I don't think so. No. I don't think so. I think whoever has the ability to go to the moon will go to the moon. Mm. But it's like a Super expensive project for, I don't know, like, what's really the profit margins in there, you know? Like, you're getting a whole bunch of donations, I'm guessing, and maybe government grants and, and stuff like that. So you can go and pursue and become, let's say, the first, uh, or not the first, but become an American company that makes it into space, like Tesla, for example, or SpaceX. And yeah, I don't know. I don't get it. What's his goal? I honestly What's don't know. Elon's goal for all this. I don't know. Who do you think is gonna get into space first, though? Do you think Elon or do you think um, Jeff Bezos? I think Elon's more aggressive. But then again, yeah. now Jeff has time because he stepped down from CEO. So maybe he's right. prioritizing that. I don't know. But yeah, it'll know. be a good show only to watch. I like it. I like yeah. how it's private now. Like individual companies are are pursuing this. It's not just government agencies like NASA. I mean, why? Why do you like that? Because it's. I think it's less decentralized. You know, mo there's more information. Like, like I'm sure they're gonna capture a bunch of footage and really like you know show the the full picture and i'm sure the technology I disagree. i'm sure their technology is going to be way more advanced than government agencies mm, i disagree why government's military bro when i was in the military we were working on planes from the 1970s in 2010 mm. so you could only imagine the technology the planes that are rolling out in 2020 2021 yeah, but look at these rockets Elon is creating, bro. Like, it's never been like this before. These rockets, like, landing, the way it lands and stuff, it's so unique. Right, right, right. No, yeah, I, I definitely think that it, they play certain things into it. But as far as you can't underestimate the technology that the government has and is not showing to the rest of the world. You know, it's like. Elon Musk, sure, Tesla's a, a, and SpaceX, they're massive corporations, but you can't compare that corporation to the corporation of the U.S. government that's been operating for freaking centuries. 